Hi, I'm Douglas Ward with Title Boxing. Today we're going to go over the basics of working the speed bag. Now if you've been in the gym for any length of time, you're experienced in the gym, uh, there's nothing to see here. You can move along. Because all we're going to really do is just go through seven basic steps to beginning speed bag work. To begin with, you want to adjust the platform so that the fattest part of the bag is eye level. That's the proper height for your speed bag. Next, you want to stand close enough to the bag that you're not reaching for it. You also want the bag bouncing close to your eyes so that you get used to something coming in close to your eyes like a punch. Uh, that way you're not blinking. That's a natural reaction is just to blink when something's coming in close to your eyes. It's, it's a natural protective mechanism that's built in. This will help you counteract that effect. From there, you want to strike the bag with the fleshy part of your hand right here, just because it's a little bit more forgiving and it'll give you a little bit more control of the bag. At the start, just begin by touching the bag. Just touch it nice and slow. Don't get over anxious and try to hit the bag real hard or, or you won't be able to keep up. Just nice and easy. Touch, touch, touch. Next, the bag is going to bounce three times before you hit it again. So listen to the rhythm. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Get used to adjusting to that rhythm. Remember to always keep your hands up high as you're, as you're hitting the bag. If you drop your hands, it takes you too long to get back up into position to hit the bag again, and you'll never be able, be able to keep up with it. So keep your hands nice and high and in constant motion. Be sure to always keep your hands moving. There should be constant perpetual movement of your hands in a circular fashion over and over. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. As time goes on, you can get more complex with your movements, shifting your weight, varying the, how you strike the bag, but this is a good place to start. You know, there are many benefits to working the speed bag. It's about coordination, timing, getting your rhythm down. As much as anything, it's, just, it's about remaining and maintaining concentration for a solid three minutes of each round. Begin with perfecting the basics and you'll be making music with this thing in no time.